Hey guys, welcome back to a very, very brand new episode of Foot Hard Mac Cross Gacha Videos. As you can tell, it is the 1st of January thanks to the message from our diva Cheryl No. So, Ake Mashte Omedeto Gozaimasu Mina san. Happy New Year to everyone out there. Hopefully, it is the 1st of January for most of you guys uh, um, if you're watching this video because I know some of you are probably on the um, western side of the world so technically you're still in the 31st of December um, till maybe about 5 hours or so from now um, at this point of time that I'm recording this video it should be almost midnight for you guys so anyway guys let's look forward to the brand new year that is 2021 and let's dive back into the wonderful love of Utah Macross with all the brand new stuff that's coming out for the new year. So first things off, let's talk about this. The bingo mission cards. Or rather, whoops, I accidentally tapped into the Valkyrie operations. Um, so let me just back out here for zip. That's a problem when you have the buttons so close to each other and I have fat fingers, so that's not going to help. So, bingo missions! <laughs> Alright, so if you guys have not started to clear, as you can tell, I haven't really been clearing this myself. If you guys need help with the bingo missions, do let me know which mission you are looking for to translate. Um, you can find the post on my YouTube Facebook page. Make sure you just take a screenshot, circle whichever mission you want to get translated and post it in the comments of that particular post regarding um, you know, the bingo missions itself. So yes guys, if not, you can actually just you know, comment um, in this particular video as well which page, uh, which particular square um, of the bingo missions that you wish to get help with. If not, you know, you can just take a look at the, all the rewards that you can get from the bingo missions, which is a lot of the uh, ChoGQ Galaxy tickets, which is fantastic because each ticket is technically an episode plate. Then of course, there's the event five star episode plate as well, um, which is going to help with the current event, which will give you that bonus percentage of points, which is fantastic. And of course, you know, not forgetting that, you know, they, they do have this ticket, which is fantastic because um, this is that leading towards um, a particular gacha. So we'll dive into the gacha page, which is what we are here for. Um, so yes, um, let's tap into the gacha page and we'll talk about all the brand new gachas that are currently available for the new year. Um, and which one is the most beneficial. And of course, we have the current running one, which is the 10 free episode plates that gives you also the chance of pulling 6 star episode plates, which is fantastic. Um, very generous of Dana. And of course, we have these two brand new step up gachas. So they feature five different divas each. Basically, if you're missing any of the divas, six star episode plates or maybe just short of one single copy of their six stars to evolve it to a seven star um you might want to invest a bit of your money your real life money into buying the discounted packs which is currently going on um sadly to say unlike the past um we've all seen you know uta macross or dana usually um creates more than what you currently see on hand like they will be discounted packs for 10,000 yen, um, 5,000 yen, that kind of stuff. But currently we've only got a 12,000 yen discounted pack and a special um, SP set discounted pack which comes with a ticket um, for a particular gacha here. So, so, so that's kind of a bummer that there's only so few discounted packs. Uh, I guess they just really want to wreck in the dough with the higher um costing discounted packs which i will eventually buy later and i'll tell you why because well this is the main reason why so if you want to pull this gacha um which is the most um i would say affordable to the buck um mainly because well this discounted pack is the one that we are talking about um which is this one which is the 3060 yen um, discounted pack that comes with 500 singing stones and of course that SP gacha ticket that we require to pull this gacha of course you can get the ticket from 
the bingo missions as well so you can actually get you know um, to try and pull from this gacha now what's so special about this particular gacha is because it is a uh, guaranteed all five stars rarity and above so it is possible to pull a six star episode plate as well so all 10 episode plates that you're gonna pull from this gacha are going to be five star rarity and above so it's definitely going to be worth your 3060 yen um investment which is technically about um 30 us dollars 31 if you want to round it up 31 us dollars investment very very worth it because if you're gonna end up pulling six star episode plates and if your luck is there for the new year you might end up with more than one copy of a six star episode plate but even if you don't get a six star episode plate all the five star episode plates are going to benefit you in some way some may be brand new some some may be old towards you you know some of them might evolve a pre-existing episode plate in your collection or maybe they'll be unlocking special um bonuses you know special pages to the uh existing seven star or fully evolved um six star evolved uh, episode plates that you currently own which will give you a chance to unlock the other lucky notes and of course to improve it into a kira kira version if you guys have no idea what i'm talking about you really need to go catch up all your time across um, and go and watch all the tutorial videos I have currently on my YouTube channel regarding all this terminology. So, <laughs> alright, so aside from that, of course, there is Makina's brand new 7 star episode plate gacha. Oh boy, so there's a lot of, there's a lot of money <laughs> being tossed into Uta Macross at the start of the year, as usual. Um, so, yes, I am in, I am prepared, my wallet is ready to cry. Um, for the love of the culture, so let's let's start things off with, um, you know, purchasing the singing stones first. So I'll see you guys in just a sec. Okay, we are back. So let's do the first gacha, which is the free 10 plate pool. Uh, hopefully, we might um, kind of wash away the bad luck first before we do all the fantastic stuff. Um, then, of course, we'll talk about the step up gacha and why I think it's actually beneficial for you to pull it, uh, especially if you are currently missing any of the um, 10 or rather, there's more than 10 episode plates that are 7 stars right now because, well, there are some divas that just have a bit more love than others. <coughs> Mikumo, I'm talking about you. <laughs> so yes, guys, um, let's start off with this 10 free plates pool. Hopefully, we have some decent luck. You know, of course, if the luck is not here, I kind of uh, will be thankful because this is definitely not one of the gachas that you should be focusing on. But of course, if you're a free-to-play player, I guess that's probably where you want to focus your luck on. Hmm. So yeah, here we go. It's been a while since we did a, a gacha pool on the, the channel. And of course, you can see the horrible luck is not there. I mean, the horrible luck is totally there. It's not a single plate that is like red and, you know. So, let's move along quickly. 
don't want to waste our time in a horrible gacha. Okay. Alright. Okay, so we can tell that not even a single plate is like <laughs> of a red rarity. So that's horrible. Alright, now that we've flushed out a bit of the bad luck, let's hope that um, from here things go a bit more smoother. Okay. Alright, so the first thing we want to talk about is probably the step up gacha. So like I said, um, if you are missing technically any of the older 6 star, 7 star plates um, that is featured here, as you can tell each of the divas have its own. And surprisingly enough, Freya's episode plate is the latest that she has, which is the more powerful version, which is fantastic as well. I think, I think Mikumo's is the same. Um, so let's take a look at the gacha's information here, and take a look at the 5 available Valkyrie plates that they are featuring. So Kaname's is a max of 4,020, 4, which is not exactly a lot compared to the newer ones, you will see why in a second. So initially, I was going to plan to make a video talking about um, the, the current existing 7-star plates and ranking them according to which is the most useful. Well, uh, it's all come down to all the information that is currently available here because there's really only that particular thing which is the total score that is differentiating all the episode plates aside from who is being able to use it, you know. So definitely... Um, look towards uh, getting an episode plate that has a better total score. So Kaname sadly has only one... Uh, no, actually there is two. Kaname has two 7-star episode plates, just that this one is the older one. Um, so that's why it has a max total of 4,200 score. Sorry, 4,020 um, total score. Then Reina's... Reina's... I think she only has one, if I recall. So 4,022. Um, slightly better than Kaname's by a tiny bit. And then of course we have Makina, which is 4,090. As you can tell, um, you know, down the line we are moving towards better and better episode plates. So definitely, um, if you look at who is in the last place, you definitely know that um, Freya is the best episode plate out of the five. And Mak uh, Mikumo is coming in at 4,096. And Freya with her brand new episode plate. Oh! It's actually lower <laughs> than Mikumo. Ha! <laughs> okay, but I guess... I guess um, Freya's is actually better in terms that, you know, it is the only blue plate that is featured here compared to Kaname that is of a better total score. So, okay, so in terms of total score, Mikumo's is actually the best. So if you guys actually plan to pull from this step up gacha, you definitely want to try and attain Mikumo's episode plate. Um, or maybe if you're just pulling it because you need to complete or attain a missing Divas 6-star version of its episode plate to, you know, just unlock the costumes and all that. That's also, a, a, you know, an all-round reasonable uh, factor to why you're pulling in this step-up gacha. So, the thing about this step-up gacha is, on the last step, which is step 4, you are guaranteed a 6-star episode plate. So yes, you're going to have to spend, let's see, let's count the math here. So step 1 and step 3 are the discounted um, pools, which are both 300 singing stones. So that itself is 600 stones itself. Step 2 and step 4 are definitely the full costing price of a regular gacha pool. So 1,000 singing stones plus 600 singing stones, a total of 1,600 stones is needed to pull the entire four steps of each step up gacha. So you would need 3,200 singing stones if you want to pull all four steps from both step up gachas and of course to attain that guaranteed six star episode plate um, that is at the end of each um, you know, step set up for both gachas. So 3,200 singing stones. Look at what I have currently. I have 4,715. This is after purchasing both the discounted packs or rather the promotional packs that is currently available in the singing stone store. And we have yet to talk about Makina's, you know, regular brand new 
seven star gacha. So, uh, of course, it would definitely be better to go with the brand new gacha because Makina's episode plate is going to, you know, um, be needed for the bonus point factor in all the current events in January. And of course, looking at Makina's plate, it is 4,276, the highest we've seen so far um, in terms of brand new 7 star episode plate compared to what we've seen with Mikumos that was around 4,098. Uh, 4, so <laughs> Makina's plate is definitely way better. Um, definitely you want to go towards getting Makina's episode plate itself. So, hmm, okay. Let's do this in order. Now that we have cleared the 10 free plate pool, let's go with Makina's current main brand new gacha. Um, we're gonna try and attain uh, Makina's episode plate. Um, then of course, we'll, we'll move on to the guaranteed 5 star and above gacha pool. Then followed by the step up gachas if we do have remaining singing stones, you know, for this. So, okay, um, let's talk about Makina's episode plate like we usually do. We'll break it down. 4,276. Fantastic total score we've seen on any current gen 7 star episode plate. And of course, well balanced stats all around as usual for a 7 star, but this one focuses a bit more on charm, which is the pink one. And of course, a bit more on soul as compared to soul so as usual you know if you have um, this episode plate uh, plate equipped and you're playing on a macross delta series because makina is from that franchise um you will gain that double s ranking center skill um you know the usual stuff from a seven star episode plate then of course we have that um twice activated active skill um, so for 15 seconds, you score your score is boosted by 100% up. You can activate it twice if it's fully evolved to its 7-star form. Uh, life skill, S rank, decent. So at the 40 second mark, for 12 seconds long, you will have an easier time tapping your notes. And for the last page, as usual, until now, we have yet to see any 7-star episode plate that comes with a special note attached to it. I guess Dana is still not ready to break the pattern. You know, it's been technically one whole year since the seven star um, episode plates have been introduced into the game. So that's fine. That's fine. Take things at your own pace, Dana. Uh, eventually, you know, we'll get there. Seven star plates with special notes. And then that's when the whalers are going to have to toss in even more money because they want the latest thing. So here we go, guys. Um, I've already put my single... Um, free pool. So if you guys didn't know yet, I, um, this will be the first time you probably hear me say about it because I have not updated Utah Macross ever since its um, update um, with Gachas having its first free pool. You know the you know usually you pay fifty singing stones just for one single pool on the Gacha, but Dana has um, become a bit more generous. The very first pool on a single um, a chance for a brand new gacha will be free. So yes, I've already done that single pool for Makina's brand new gacha. Um, so we'll go ahead with the usual third um, discounted first template pool and then we'll see how things go. But of course there is this thing which is I can use this ticket um, that is gotten through the subscription of um, you know um, the special pass so if you do pay the monthly subscription you will gain these uh, free 10 tickets which will give you 10 episode click pools as well but sadly to say they are all single pools you can't do all 10 at one go that's kind of annoying i wish they now would change that uh, means of you know oh we can oh we can <laughs> i can do all 10 click pools here with all the tickets that I've gotten through my subscription. Okay, that's that's fantastic. I'm sorry, Dana, for dishing out <laughs> you know the information that I, I wish you could. Apparently you did. Uh, I just that I never I never did it this way before. <laughs> so <laughs> my bad, my bad. Okay. So let's do the ten pool uh, a first ten pool with all the tickets that I've gotten through the subscription of uh, special pass and let's see how things go. Hopefully we are a bit lucky with just this free 10 tickets so I can save my singing stones for the rest of the other gachas available at this point of time. 
Hmm, let's see, what do we have? We get a bit of loading, so that's a pretty good sign. Okay. There we go. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, five Valkyries, so there is a chance that there might be a rainbow box. Oh, we do get a rainbow box from the first blink. And lots of red boxes, so hopefully that rainbow evolves to a six-star play. Oh, oh, no evolution image? Oh, come on. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. You know, attaining a 5-star plate is still fantastic, you know. Um, of course, extra points towards the costume. And of course, if you really unlock the costume, it gets uh, more points to hit towards the episode op, which can be used to unlock costumes that you have yet to unlock, which is also good. Alright, so the first red box is not um, evolving. Ooh, ooh, this is new. Well, at least to me. Okay. So none of the red boxes evolve, so that's kind of a bummer. But that's fine. I mean, considering that this is like considered a free, free template pool. Oh, at least my five star evolved to its six star form. So I'm, I'm good. I'm actually pretty happy. Ah. Okay. So yeah, this plate is new to me. I wonder which costume it leads to. Oh. So I think I've already unlocked that costume for Milane. So that's fine. Alright, so let's dive into the discounted template pool version of Makina's Gacha. Um, hopefully we get to pull uh, Makina's brand new 6 star, 7 star episode plate. You know, so here we go. The first discounted pool of the new year. Okay, we get a loading there, even though we've already loaded a bit in the beginning. Alright, here we go. One, two, three. Oh, three Valkyries only. Okay, that's kind of sad. Oh, no red boxes on the first blink. Okay, so we're really gonna have to count on luck on evolving those red boxes. Hmm. Okay, here's the first one. So no evolution on the first one. Oh, we get Ray Ray. Alright, that's fine. Okay, moving along. Second one. No evolution on this one either. Oh, what's with all the old episode plates? It's a new year! Give me the new stuff! <laughs> oh, come on! Okay, the last one. Oh, that's horrible. That is horrible. It's Makina, but it's not. Uh, at least it's Maki Ray Gacha Poo, but it's it's not the new stuff. Oh, that's sad. So sad. Okay. Okay. Alright, so we do have enough, technically, to do um, a usual template non discounted poo. As long as I have 3000, um, I guess 3002, yeah? For the step up gacha, I think I'm fine. Okay, so how about this? Let's move on to the step up gachas first before we return back to Makina's gacha. You know, of course, if you guys have not gotten Basara's brand new um, Christmas costume as well, there is that as well. And oh, 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 this is the bingo gacha. So, oh. So this SP gacha can only be oh it can only be pulled if you buy that special discount pack. Because the bingo ticket was very similar in design as compared to the SP ticket, so I got a bit confused. So apparently, okay, if you clear all the bingo missions, then yes, you'll get the ticket to pull from here, which is a guaranteed five-star episode plate. And then of course you can take a look at the five-star plates that are currently available in this gacha. So it's taking a bit of time to load. Uh, I guess I guess they, they, they don't give you the details of the five episode plates. Um, <laughs> I mean the images are all here, so technically we can't really compare which one is better. But of course, if you see a costume that you have yet to unlock, then of course you will definitely be praying to get that particular episode plate instead of the rest, I suppose. So yeah, let's go towards the step up gacha. Let's move on. Um, and get things rolling. So here we go, the first step of this particular Valkyrie Step Up Gacha. So I'm really wondering which um, diva I'll pull out its um, 6 star episode plate. 
Um, there are some of them that I'm actually missing from my collection, so I'm hoping that it might be that one that I'm missing. So here we go. Okay, we get three planes. So as you can see, the luck is starting to retain its uh, consistency. Alright, lots of red boxes. Here we go. Okay, clearing out all the regular stuff first. Where's the red boxes? All coming at the end. Here we go, the very first one. Ooh, Freya looking very... I don't know. Oh, we get a duplicate. Okay, that's kind of a bummer. <laughs> okay, so we have one last red box. Will it evolve? No, no evolution. So the luck is still retaining at the three red box factor with no evolution inside. So that's kind of a bummer. Oh, the Freya plate is new. Oh. Oh, she's, she's looking... Very, um, you know, confident. So hopefully with the next pool, we might get something good. <laughs> so yes, let's make use of uh, Freya's confidence to move on with the next gacha pool. Here we go. So this one should be a 500 regular pool. Um, it might have its luck improved though. Yeah, so oh, it guarantees a 5 star. So step 2 guarantees a 5 star episode plate. I had a regular 500 stone pool, so let's do this. Let's go. I wonder if I have enough materials to power up all the episode plates that I just attained. Oh god, <laughs> that is that worry as well. Okay, here we go. Oh, we get five planes. One. Two. Oh, a single rainbow box. Could it evolve? to a 7 star or 6 star. Okay. If the rainbow box is at the end, there might be a chance. I mean, considering that any of the plates can actually evolve. So. Who knows. And here we go. No evolution on it. But okay, that's our guaranteed 5 star plate. So that's fine. And, and it's a pretty good episode plate. This, this episode plate of Kaname's is actually one with the special note. So that's pretty good in terms for the current event that we are going through. So you need that special note to actually help you improve yourself in ranking. So yes, you need this. So I'm, I'm pretty okay with this. I'm pretty okay with this um, particular pool. Not too bad. Okay, so the next one should be a discounted one. Oh, it's not. It's not discounted. Oh, wow. So the last, oh, then we're going to end up spending more. Oh, okay, so we're going to have to end up using 4,000 singing stones to pull the entire two step-up gachas. Oh my goodness, that is expensive. Okay, so guys, yes, you will need 4,000 singing stones to pull all steps of both step-up gachas. Wow. Okay, let's go. So I guess we might not be able to pull Martina's gacha again. Oh no, what is this horrible luck? It's the new year, come on! Okay. Mm -hmm. Not that we need to see all this regular stuff. Where is my single red box? Here we go. Will it evolve? No evolution. It's a bummer. Oh well. Okay, so not a very exciting pool. And here we have the final step, which will guarantee a six star episode plate. Now I just wonder which character will I get. Uh, I do need Freya's brand new episode plate, so that's the main thing that I'm looking forward to. So here we go. Oh boy. Come on Freya, come home to me. I just need you and I'll complete all the current Valkyrie episode plates that I that is currently in 7 star form. Uh -huh, here we go. So as usual, we will see very nice Valkyrie formations because it's a guaranteed 6 star pool. Oh, two red boxes. So is one of the red boxes going to evolve to a 
six star episode of Plague Street Away. Okay, so that's our costume point for Freya. Alright, nope, this one's not gonna evolve. Ooh, lots of gory gory! Uh, is this a sign that I might get Freya's new episode plate? Please let it be- Okay, there we go, there we go, the red box is going to evolve to its six star form. Oh, direct evolution! Oh! It is not Freya! Oh, why? It is Maki Maki, but okay, that's fine, that's fine. It's okay! Oh, 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 it evolved into seven star form! Oh, that's nice! Okay, okay, I, I can forgive, I can forgive this pool, <laughs> even though it's not Freya, but at least at least it involves an uh, episode plate that I have yet to get it to its 7 star form, so that's, that's okay. That's okay in my book. Okay, so I guess we're moving on to the next step up gacha, um, which, you know, consists of the other three Macross franchises. So, um, so the one that I'm missing, I think, I think, okay, so the one that we've completed has disappeared. So the one that I need, I've already completed um, Ranka's 7 star, so it's fully evolved. I think Sharrow's is incomplete. Um, I have Milane's fully evolved as well. I don't think I have Min Mei. Or do I have Min Mei fully evolved? Hmm. I think I'm short of Basara. So the one I want is really Basara. So here we go. Here we go, here we go. The first one is a discounted pool. I thought step. 3 would have been discounted as well, considering the old patterns of the Step Up Gacha. So, surprisingly it's not. So, uh, my bad on the misinformation right there. But well, that's fine. At least we get to experience it, or rather you get to see me experience it before you decide to, to do your own pulls. Hopefully, hopefully. Here we go. So only one red box this time round. That's kind of a bummer. Alright, here we go. No evolution to it, that's fine. Okay. Oh, okay. At least Elto's played Evolve. Got something out of it. Not too bad. Alright. Moving on to step 2. Okay, and we'll get a guaranteed 5 star episode plate as well. So it did say 5 star, it didn't say 5 star in the book, so definitely the plate will not evolve, so I guess that's the reason why I shouldn't have kept my hopes up on the last step of gacha. Oh well. Bling. Come on. There we go, the rainbow box. Okay. So let's see, do we get bonus plate evolving? You know, still there's a chance that the red boxes might evolve. There we go. Oh, there it is, the evolution of the red box. Okay, it's another 5 star. So we get Cheryl's gorgeous episode plate. That's fine. Okay. Lots of frontier love, which is always good. So no evolution on this one. Okay, so at least if this plate is new, at least I get a fully evolved version of Minmei's plate. Here we go, the guaranteed 5 star. Ah! Can we get some fire bomber love? Oh, it's new for me! Interesting. Okay, yeah, we get Cheryl's Sh gorgeous plate evolving, so that's, that's a win-win. And this Minmei's plate is also new to me. Or rather, yeah, at least it's evolution form. Alright, pretty decent, step 2 pool, not too bad, and of course, step 3 is going to be horrible just like the other one, I think. <laughs> oh well, so here we go, step 3. Look at me burn away all my singing stones. Well, it's still not as bad as compared to all the whalers out there, so still. Here we go. 1, 2, 3. Four, five. Oh, we get a decent Valkyrie animation for this step. All 
Alright. Oh, we get a rainbow box. Not too bad compared to the last step three that we did. <laughs> Alright, let's keep on rolling with the good luck. Oh, at least decent luck. Oh, 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 something's gonna evolve. Hey, it's going to evolve! Oh my god! I got another six star! And it's not even the guaranteed one. It's Cheryl! Yes, look at that. Ooh, so much love and affection. Okay. Is it is it gonna evolve? Or do I have Cheryl click to evolve? Already? So that's gonna be interesting to find out. Okay. Oh, Evolve Cheryl's Plate! Nice! Another 7 star to the collection. Fantastic, fantastic stuff. Alright. And let's move on to step 4, which will guarantee me another 6 star episode plate. Dang, the new year is looking good. Okay, let's go, let's go. And we've yet to do the guaranteed 5 star rarity and above SP ticket pool. So that's going to be a finale. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh, horrible Valkyrie animations, but we at least get the guaranteed 6 star episode plate. There we go. So, washing the bad luck with some guaranteed luck. Okay. So no evolution for the red box. That's kind of a bummer. That's fine. Oh, it's gonna evolve! Oh my goodness! Okay, it retains its... Okay, that's fine! A 5 star episode plate out of the horrible luck. That's, that's good. I wonder if it's gonna evolve the lane plate though. And here we go, we have the guaranteed 6 star. Nice. Oh, lots of Melane love! Uh, sadly to say, I have this fully evolved already. I wish it was Basara's plate, but you know, having a plus one luck on this 7 star is definitely nice as well. Okay, so apparently, yeah, both plates of Melane are fully evolved. So we're getting secret bots for it. Fantastic stuff! Alright, and here we go, we have the finale. Unless we have extra stones to pull. Oh, we do have extra stones. So we can actually pull Makina's gacha one more time. Should we go for it? I mean, considering that the luck is, well, I mean, kind of used up. Okay, let's go for it. Let's just go for it. Let's do this. Let's get Makina's episode played. Here we go, guys. Alright, we get a bit of loading there. A very quick one, so that's kind of worrying. One, two, three. No, four, five? Okay. Oh no. Okay. Two red boxes at the end. Well, we can hope for an evolution. Okay. Seems like. Oh no, it's not gonna evolve. Oh no. Oh no. Maki Maki's not coming home. Oh no. Oh. Oh wow, at least there are some new plates there. But still. Oh, that's just horrible. Oh well. Oh well, at least we can end the gacha video on an uh, uh, exciting note with the guaranteed 5 star and above 10 plate pool so yes guys this is the reason why you should invest in that um you know that special bundle in the singing stone store this is definitely going to be worth your money if you can afford to buy um you know the, the stones yeah uh, if you need to do it by you know um store credit you know i mean like not store credit i mean gift cards vouchers uh whatever means that you have to uh purchase in-game currency with whatever platform you are using, be it Android or uh, iPhone, you know, you, you know the ways to purchase um, digital credits. Just make sure that you don't burn a hole in your, your wallet. I mean, this is definitely the best deal that Lena has provided so far. 
uh, out of all the three years that Blue Time and Cross is running. So this is definitely one that you should invest in. So here we go, guys. The guaranteed five star and above rarity ten plate pools. Look at that loading. Oh, look at that wonderful loading. Here we go. I wonder what we're gonna get. Oh, right. Look at this wonderful, beautiful Valkyrie animation. Oh, look at that. No golden orb though, so... Bling! Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at that. Oh, wonderful, wonderful stuff. So it would be nice to see one of the rainbow box evolve. Oh, 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 wow. Duplicate. Okay. Shadow love. Lots of shadow love. Oh, this is going to evolve. Yes, look at that. How far will it evolve? Okay. Okay, Milane gets lots of love this episode as well. Okay, this one's gonna evolve again. Will it evolve further? Nope. Okay. We one can hope. Okay, Makina gets lots of love this episode as well. Oh, this one's gonna evolve. No, no, oh, oh, Ranka gets love. Yes. Okay. No evolution? Ah, oh, I was hoping to get a 6 star at least. Well, Tanami gets some love. Okay, will it stay to its golden box form or near? Maki Maki gets lots of love. Okay. Oh, Milane gets even more love. Wow. How many plays is this now? Oh, Milane gets lots of love. <laughs> Are we almost at the end? I hope it's not the end. Cheryl gets more love as well. And that's the end. So I didn't get a 6 star plate out of it, but look at that. It's a guaranteed 5 star fest. Holy crap, look at that. All the plates that I've yet to evolve are evolving. Some of them are brand new, so that's fantastic. Okay. Some of them are pretty old episode plates, but that's fine, you know, considering that I don't have them. That's okay. So yeah, guys. That's it. That's it for all the gachas we have today. Technically, kind of. Well, I do have a bonus footage. So remember I said that I pulled that single free pool from Makina's brand new gacha? Well, here is what I got. Anyway guys, thank you guys so much for joining me and coming back to all the Uta Macross love if you guys have been sticking around patiently waiting for me to return. Uh, thank you guys so much for supporting me all this time even though I have been on hiatus for roughly about 4 months on Uta Macross content. Um, hopefully you guys are still playing and of course uh, if you guys you know, did gacha pools yourself before my video came out. Let me know how are your results down in the comment section below. And of course, if you guys did your own pools later on after watching my videos, after being convinced that, you know, that 10 plate guaranteed 5 star episode plate pool is worth the money. Let me know what did you get down below in the comments as well. And of course, if you guys are brand new to Uta Macross, you, go, you can go and hit up all my tutorial videos in the tutorial playlist for Uta Macross. Uh, cut yourself up with all the lingo and uh, know-hows of playing this game. And of course, if you have not subscribed to the channel but you are following my content, what in the world are you doing? Click that subscribe button, hit that bell notification icon, and leave a like to this video if you enjoyed watching me flush all my money down the drain. <laughs> well, technically it's not an entire waste. We are supporting Macross franchise through Uta Macross itself. 
And of course, we are supporting Dana in the production of Utah Necross and keeping the game fun and fresh in whatever means um, necessary. So if you guys uh, have not filled out the, um, the form um, that Dana is doing in the main screen, I'm, I'm, I'm sure it's still there. So there is still a time period that you can fill out the, the, the questionnaire. Let's see if it's still here. Uh, yep, yeah, there it is. So if you want to fill up the questionnaire form, tap on it. Of course, hit on to the underline um, five Japanese words here. It will bring you to the website where you can fill up the questionnaires. You might need to use help with uh, Google Translate if you guys can't really read Japanese. There's quite a bit of information that's being asked. Um, the last day of submission is on the 10th of January, so you still got roughly about nine days to do this. And what what do you actually get from filling up this questionnaire? Well, you you help Dana to um, plan future events for the, the game. They are they are planning to replace certain events, and of course they are planning to add in newer characters. Yes, there is that as well inside the questionnaire form. And of course, at the end of it, after submitting the questionnaire, um. Players who have done so will get 250 singing stones as a, a reward you know, for filling up the questionnaire form. I've already mentioned this in my returning Uta Macross video for the events of January. So you can check out that video if you want to know what's coming up as well for the whole month of January. Uh, I will have that video at the end of this um, particular video as well. You know, as usual guys, thank you guys so much for coming back to join me on the adventure of Ultima time across once again let me know how you guys did for all your gacha pools whichever ones you did uh, be it the step up uh, be it the 10 free play pools that they had from christmas till now and of course did you buy the sp ticket um and of course makina's brand new episode pick gachas um what kind of results did you get from pulling all this stuff you know of course if you guys need help with the bingo missions let me know on youtube facebook page as well links in the descriptions down below make sure you guys follow me there and of course one more thing yes i do stream on twitch twitch link in the description as well make sure you follow me there if you like to join me and chill out and you know have a good time um, gaming games that i love uh, and i'll see you guys in the next Uta macross video until then bye <laughs>